Hey everybody, so welcome to another video of the 91 Donruss Elite Search. Um, so I have something for you here. I could really kick myself for not recording this. Um, first off, I love opening packs so much that sometimes when I'm bored, I just come grab a few random packs and open them, right? Well, get this. I grabbed just one pack from a different box, not this one. This is a uh, that one box I did the other day. This is the last half of it. But I grabbed just one pack from another box. And this is what I got. I hope you believe me, because <laughs> I didn't record it. But this is what I got. The Ricky Henderson Elite. And I took it out, and I'm like, why didn't I record this? Uh, at any rate, um, so I thought I would share that. Why not? And go to the other box and try for another. I think where I bought this from, my local um, LCS, I don't think all those boxes he had came from the same case because I'm hearing there's only like one or so per case. So I think it's very random, all these boxes. This is only like the third, fourth box I've got. And here we go. All right, well, again, <laughs> I could kick myself for not recording that, but let's, let's just go through these. Who knows, could be another one there. One pack, I grabbed one pack and there it was. You can comment, I don't know, I hope you believe me. <laughs> it was, I'm not gonna lie, it came out of one of those boxes. All right, so let's just go on to this one. Excuse the lighting a little bit, because I usually do this during the day from sunlight. Um, and I'm kind of using not the best lighting, so I think it's pretty good though. Uh, anyway, there's a Diamond King that I usually keep. Tim Tuffle. This is Larry Walker, second year. I feel bad. I wish I would have. I, I just sat there staring at like, why? Why did I do this? Why? But again, I just, I just love opening packs so much that I um, get bored and just, oh, I'm going to open a few. I'm just going to open a few. <laughs> One pack. And I knew it right away because, you know, you open them this way and I see the little... You know, the, the back side, the green. It's like, ah, uh, what, what luck, right? Uh, Matt Williams, Ray Langford. Joe Carter, the Ron Gant, Bo Jackson highlight. Again, I'm trying to get all the highlight cards. Let's just hope there's one in this box. Maybe I'll get lucky. Kind of makes me, you know, as I, I have, uh, let's see, I, I have one more Series 1 box left and like one and a half Series 2. And since I get them for a pretty good price, um, There's Mark McGuire. I after this, I might I might get some more from there if he's got some. Um, again, they're they're such a good price, and you know I'm keeping the, the Hall of Famers. I'm keeping the um, highlight cards. See the highlight cards are a special. See BC ten um, to make a set of those. So you know it's just, to me it's worth it. The ten bucks, and then the rest, like I've said before, I just donate kids or something. Craig Biggio, Dave Stewart. Uh, so one of these days, I'll catch it on video. Kind of makes me want to do more and more. I hope no one's getting bored of the same one all the time. Uh, I. Just, trying to get um, like a 92 or something 
uh, but he didn't have any more. It's Cal Ripken. Henry Cotto. Bobby Bonilla. Again, I hope the lighting's good enough here. Remember, I'm small budget, so got an old iPhone 7. <laughs> I uh, put up stuff on eBay to sell stuff that I don't keep for a personal collection. Um, you know, so I can get the money comes around to keep buying the packs and stuff. Mark McGuire highlight. However, these George Brett, these searches are are fun though. I mean, it's exciting. You know, granted, this is one of the sets that in the junk wax era that you know is not very desirable. You know, there's so many of them made. Now, of course, the elites, you know, ten thousand made. Um, at any rate, I mean. I think this card's around fifty dollars. If I bought five boxes, ten bucks each, there you go. You know. Phil Plantier. Anyway, it's, one of these days I'll catch it. One of these days. Like I said, just makes me want to do more. Canseco. And Caminiti. Down to four, what is that? Nine, eight, eight packs. So this is that rest of the first box. Again, the Elite I got out of a whole different box. I can't believe I grabbed one pack and there it was. Right on top. Craig BGO again, there's Highlight Stewart. I think it's kind of like the same pack we saw earlier. So if anyone knows, make a comment. Um, I believe the elites are one, maybe two per case. And again, I don't know if my LCS, I don't think he, he bought by the case. When he got all this stuff, he, it was just a random, um, some collector, some guy had stuff and he bought everything. There's McGriff, Tony Gwynn, Dave Parker, Gary Carter highlight, that was a nice one. Tom Gordon. Five to go. What luck. I, you know, open boxes of these and, you know, packs and packs and packs, and I grab one and I get that without. Recording. Uh. Gray Olson. Sandberg highlight. The highlights have a lot of um, stars and, and Hall of Famers, and I mean, that's pretty good. So if I can get a set or more, since I've got so many of these. That would be cool.
Ozzy Smith, Bo Merrill. All right, two to go. Fielder. Cal Ripken. Last one. And of course, you know, nothing there. <laughs> Parker, oh, that pack looked familiar. Well, anyway, so still, I hope you enjoyed it. I just wanted to share. Um, there'll be more to come. We'll catch one one of these days. Give me a sub if you already haven't, and click the like button, and we'll see you next time. Thanks.